an Olympian. She is a Commonwealth Games champion. She's one of my biggest competitors on the international circuit. Let's see what she can do, what she can show us. Starting with a front three. Wow. Beautiful. Prelim was a little shaky. She got out all the dives that she didn't want to do in the finals. This rip entry is beautiful. You can see how aggressive she is on that pop on the tower. This is an amazing start. So far, this final. 3.2 DD. She can put this one down. I've seen her do it. In words, usually on the higher end of the spectrum of the DDs. Really great to see these three and a halfs in this event. Gorgeous. Wow. Try and roll it over, but she knows exactly where she is. Like I said again before, she has so much experience compared to the rest of the field um, and really knows how to deal with her nerves. Technically, again, same as her first dive, beautiful start. No complaints from Andrea nope. in this final so far. Arm stand double, one and a half twist with a DD of 3.2. I feel comfortable. I'm just like, oh, I'm watching a show. Really, really nice diving. She's three for three. She wants that gold medal. Beautiful back arm. There said, don't worry, I'm gonna do some good dives. So well. she knows she's on. 76 points on that dive. So now, Andrea on the 10 meter doing a back two and a half with one and a half twists. She wants to keep her lead. She's gonna have to put it down. Another diver that just loves diving so much. Competing for that first spot, currently in first going into this round. With a higher DD than Renee and 15 points ahead. Gorgeous. Next dive from Andrea. She put on quite a performance in this final. She's four for four, very consistent. That is what is gonna get you in from prelims. One thing I think she knows is that prelims is always about getting to finals. You don't have to put on your best show and give it all in the prelim. You want to do your best, but really want to put everything down in the final. And she did just that. Sending kisses back home. Happy girl.